Claws at the bottom is uh, if the bottom is black from which no light can escape, wielded by Anna, Sword Hand of Night, engraved with Smith's script, uh, enabling strong attack to launch all three claws at a target. The blades are only semi corporeal and cannot be guarded against. Interesting. Pure uh, uh, dex weapon. Usual, it's the usual attack pattern of the claws. Same, same one as the base game, I think. Jump bar two. Yeah, you certainly launched them. Oh, shit. It's a cool weapon art. These are pretty cool, actually. I can do ambush attack with perfumes. You can't. You gotta switch to a dagger. You, you walk up behind them and grab them by the throat and tilt their head back and pour the perfume in their mouth. And their heads just explode. There's a statue. Oh, we're about to face a boss. Fingerprint nostrum. There's a statue of America over there, too. It's, it's, we're gonna get ported to some arena or something. So it's either gonna be a Giga Hand or like an Astol clone, is my hunch. Either. What the fuck is this? Okay. My tear mother of fingers. Really? She's the mother of the fingers? It is a big hand thing. I was right. It was some Giga handballs. Oh yes, Daddy. Flutie got fingered. True. Bro, we dish out some damn. Not bad. We haven't ruined in a while. Well, we only have eleven left. Like we're barely finding any in this DLC. TBH.
seems like a very bad thing. What the hell is happening? They said. Oh, he's gonna explode. Oh yeah, there. Hello? We just have to run with it. Whatever direction it's pointing. Dude, how did that spray not hit it? I was literally staggered from. This is, this is where the fight starts to get not good. Freaking random mats. How, how did that spray not kill that guy? segments of just not being able to DPS this boss. But also not like... I'm okay with that when it's something like, uh, you know, Mesmer or whatever, where you're, it's because you're dodging and you're waiting for an opportunity. Elden Beast style shit, where you're just like running across a massive arena. That's not, not the best. Uh, sir, I'm over here. Or madam. Finger. Thing. Triple. At this time, I was like, oh, I remember it. Now it's a double. Now she does a triple. human could conceive this no sober human could conceive this chat I think I need, I need to dial back the aggression I'm trying to get two to three R ones in when it should be one to two depending on what she's doing so I keep getting hit I need to respect this fight a little more it kind of seemed like I'm a good fight with how easy the phase one was but we're burning through a lot of healing Okay, 
there should have just been one R1. What the fuck is this? What's happening? That shit hits so hard. Man. I think that's that runaway angle of that one. Must be able to iframe through that. How does it feel to have this boss flicking your little bit? Is it as enjoyable as it looks? There's three. Oh! No way. Okay. Jesus. <sighs> uh, yeah, that was pretty easy. It's not a gimmick fight, but it's kind of whatever. Not a bad fight either. It's just. Uh, that that was like the Astol fight of the DLC to me, basically. Three three deaths. What was her name? Metier. Mother of fingers. That was a remembrance boss too. Okay. Here's what this is going to say. The mother of all two fingers and finger creepers was in turn a magnificently gleaming daughter of the greater will. Oh, it was like an Elden Beast style thing. Interesting. That's going to be some interesting lore. And the first shooting star to fall upon the lands between. Really? Very interesting. Cool. I bet you neat. So now we're probably going to go up to that dude and he's going to be really mad and the Black Knight chick is going to try to kill us more than likely. Let's see the remembrance first, though. Did I have the boss counter? I did not. Same blurb there. An int faith weapon. Some staff. Staff action from the tail fingers. 
Let that sink in for a sec. Tail fingers, Jan. Uh, the mother of fingers and the microcosm raised the loft over the crux they form. Catalyst for casting both sorceries and incantations. The mother receives signs from the greater world from beyond the microcosm. Despite being broken and abandoned, she kept waiting for another message to come. A strength. Int. And faith weapon. Colossal weapon. Gazing finger. The head of Matir, the finger mother, wielded as a weapon without modification. For within the center of the fingerprints that wrinkles the creature's foremost protrusion, a tiny wart like eye gazes vacantly into the beyond. There you go. How many bosses in total? I don't know. But if you know, don't tell me. I don't want to know. I want it to be a surprise. Until the end, at least. Uh, question is we could wear this now. What's our current eighty? Let's take to eighty six. Go wear gloves as well. Yeah, a little too much. Okay. Of a new age. <laughs> At least my gloves and leggings match my helmet now. Kind of. In rough color palette. Can we nuke Chow? Should I not look up? I was about to look up. I just thought, can we nuke chat? And then I stopped looking upwards. Um. Okay, so we did that. Nuke it, nuke it, don't look up. Okay. I will not look up. Also, that means if you typed a message to me, that wasn't the spoiler. Above where my son said don't look up, I did not see it. Uh, so the only other major area left to go to is here now, where the main story goes. Killed a couple of bigger bosses. Let's see if anyone has anything to say. Jack clear prevented. Well, like that way. I think you guys spammed it away. It's clear. Okay. Nothing new there. There just like aren't any NPCs left, really. For now, we still have to run into Freya and face. Lita is basically the only one left. Oh, we have to visit the dude, obviously, in the church. Where I expect we will fight for our right to finger. No longer a sanctuary, that's for sure. Meaning something is a foot or a finger. What have you done? You've wounded Count Emir most irreparably, such that he wishes for your death, and I must attend to the Count's concerns. Do you know you're talking to? The crop dust of baby. I wasn't a boss, though, right? Me a mother's strength. Look here at my feet. 
finger. Obviously, no. I will be the true mother, and I will be the only mother. Is he a boss? Mother. Oh, shit, actual boss now. Oh, good. PvP boss. Fuck's sake, man. Sorry, damage. Did you Count Emir, mother of fingers. To me, your mother. Emir's bell bearing. Maternal staff. High Priest hat. This whole outfit. Well, this entire quest line wasn't fucking weird at all. The uh, the chick we faced first was not a boss, though, right? No? Yeah, it was just like a PvP chick. Uh, Count Emir. Count Emir. Mother of Fingers. Finers? Finegers? Vinegar? I would love some salt and vinegar chips right now. But. Alright, so that's 38. Salt and Vinny's Vickies. Uh, okay, now there's nowhere to go, but. I mean. Again, as far as I know, I'm sure there's going to be more shit, but if we go this way. In terms of major areas explored, we pretty much got everything. Everyone up on this plateau, I don't know if you can, though. You still have to find, like, the paintings and stuff, but yeah. Look at this. Remembrance boss you missed? Uh, we're not finishing this playthrough without killing all the bosses, so at some point we will do them. How many moms do fingers need? You're asking the wrong question. The question is, how many fingers do moms need? The answer varies. I just realized. Oh, you made like 30k. I oh, just got a joke boss to be fair. I didn't know where to go. I'm just explore. What the fuck is this? Oh, of course. It, you know, I was wondering. It's super long bridge. They always put some kind of horseshit on these bridges. Something's casting at me. Yeah, there we go. Far side. Just gotta hurry through. I was like, there's no way a bridge this long doesn't have some kind of annoying mob at the end. That's a red hood guy, too. Jeez. That hurt. and Reign of Fire. 
52 faith. Uh, Hodos also Sage of Fire Knights prodigious, a prodigious amount of cloth uh, wound around it, giving the impression of a greatly swollen head, and wearing it increases intelligence. Hmm. Disciple of Elder Wego, he refused to burn down an old ruin at the risk of his own life. Uh, how much intelligence out of curiosity? Two. Two intelligence chip. A lot of red puddles here. But suddenly no horses allowed. Kettle salt and vinegar chips? Oh, now we're talking. Now we're talking. Bro. Yeah, just kind of like section stuff off of my head, Star Cities. Like what I've explored and what I haven't, you know. That's not what it looks like. Hey, hey, hey. Uh, this game desperately needs loadouts, especially with all this DLC gear. It's out of control, man. Out of control. Uh, I doubt it, but let me see if there's anything under this. Pillar elevator. It's a lot of dudes. Oh, fuck, dude. Wait, that's fine, that's fine. Yes, yes, yes. Come on, just one, one or two of you. It's like fade away. Fade away shit's really good actually. That was a way to go that way as well. Interesting. Priest guy. There we got still far. My Moog ability. Oh, that wasn't too bad. All that for a somber smithing stone eight. Okay. Not even anything here. Go the other way, anyways. 